Hmm. A new anime on Netflix. Oh yeah, I saw something a while ago about a new installation to the Devilman Legacy. Looks like it just came out. I wonder what it's like. So, I watched the first five minutes and gave up. Now, it wasn't because of the animation. I'm not here to badmouth the style of the series, because it's really not that bad. It's just a little janky to look at for the most part. I actually took the first five minutes trying to figure out if it was 2D or CGI. It is 2D, by the way, although it was hard to tell. I have come to that conclusion. Hard to tell from the first little bit, anyway, like the theme song and whatnot. Uh, anyway, trust me, I've watched uglier shows, and that's not the reason I wanted to say this. In the end, I decided against watching Devilman Crybaby. Why? Well, constantly ignoring the strange animation wasn't worth the possible risk of starting and then committing to watching the entirety of the series. Best to quit early before I regret it. Regretted it? Yeah, even though the music I heard was pretty promising enough to counteract the unpleasant visual style. You see, I decided to wait a couple of days. And, just as I thought, within those couple of days, the reviews started coming out. And, I got exactly what I was looking for, without being overly spoiled about the series, from the reviews that I decided to watch. Devilman Crybaby is a stylized and modernized rehash of the original Devilman manga serialized back in the 1970s. Well, that's all I needed to know. I didn't like that Devilman, and I most certainly won't enjoy this one, so I'm giving it a skip. I won't deny the merit and legacy of the Devilman franchise, along with the influence it had on the anime medium, but that doesn't mean I have to like it. The story has been retold several times, and I was kind of hoping and keep hoping for a version I can genuinely enjoy, because it seems like a waste to be constantly at odds with it. Alas, Devilman Crybaby doesn't add anything new to the themes, undertones, controversy, and uncensored glory of the original. Therefore, this is what you get in terms of my reaction to it. No one asked, but I figured I would give my two cents before it came up one way or another because this is a very hot topic in the anime world right now, and I don't see it being dropped very easily. That was to be expected of the series, after all. And that's it. I won't watch Devilman Crybaby. This ridiculous speed paint has a few more minutes to it, so if that's amusing to you, go ahead and keep watching to see how it turns out. Feel free to turn on music as you watch, as there is none in this video, unfortunately. Until next time, people of Earth and elsewhere, I hope to continue to see you on the channel where the content is spam, and I am Crackers. Ciao!